This is the solution to written homework 80. Okay, so uh, divide this by that. So because the divisor, so this is the divisor, the divisor has degree 2 and therefore we need to use long division instead of the nicer and more compact synthetic division okay so we'll use long division uh, 3 x to 4 plus 2 x to 3 plus 15 x to 2 plus x plus 44 and then divide by x squared plus 2x plus 5 Okay, so then the leading term outside is x squared, and the leading term inside is 3x to 4. So then these two will come over here for a little bit of work. The 3x to 4 divided by x squared. Well, that's 3x to 2. That partial quotient goes to the top of the house to be recorded. Then that partial quotient jumps off the house. It's the divisor on the way down. So 3x squared multiplied by x squared plus 2x plus 5. That gets written under here. So that's 3x to 4 plus 6x to 3 plus 15x squared and all of that gets subtracted <clears throat> okay the degree 4 terms zero out uh, so we'll have negative 4 x cubed and then there's no squares so plus 0 x squared and then carry down plus x plus 44 okay, one round is complete so now the leading term inside the house is that term I'm going to take that term over to here for some work it comes over negative 4x cubed divide by x squared that is negative 4x this partial quotient gets taken to the top to be recorded And then it hits the divisor on the way down. That product gets written under here. So negative 4x cubed minus.
minus 8x squared minus 20x. And then parenthesize all of that and subtract. The cubes go away, subtracting negative 8x squared, so that's 8x squared plus 21x plus 44. That round is finished. Now the leading term inside is this, which is still less or equal to degree that. So let me come over to here for some work. Eight x squared divided by x squared is eight. That partial quotient is taken to the top to be recorded. It jumps off the house, hits the divisor on the way down. So eight times x squared plus two x. 5, write that under here, 8x squared plus 16x plus 40, parenthesize all of that and subtract, the squares go away, there are then 5x's, and four units left. So now this has degree one. Which is less than the degree of the divisor. And therefore, this is where we stop the division. OK, so <clears throat> now we can list out all of these. So the dividend, that is what is being divided. So this one is 3x to 4 plus 2x to 3 plus 15x to 2 plus x plus 44. The divisor is what's doing the dividing. x squared plus 2x plus 5. The quotient is what gets recorded at the top. 3x squared minus 4x plus 8. The remainder is this bit. 5x plus 4. And then all four of these can be combined into a single equation that looks like this. Uh, well, 3x to 4 plus 2x to 3 plus 15x to 2 plus x plus 44. So the dividend is equal to the quotient. Multiplied by the divisor. plus 2x plus 5, and then plus the remainder, 5x plus 4. And it is not a proper divisor, so no, because the remainder is non-zero. The remainder 
is that. And that's the answer.